Hey, Mike Burroughs here with spiritmusicmeetups.org, a place where you can teach one another. We did some videos, I'll try to reference down below in the description, on progressively flamming two strokes and then three strokes. There was eight combinations of three strokes, but when we get into four strokes, there are 16. It just explodes, right? Boom, exponentially. Eight went to 16 just by adding one more stroke. Now I just jotted them down here. Maybe I'll put them down in the description for you. Can you see them all? See them all there? All right, that's all 16. And a good way to be able to create these 16 on the fly is the same numeric method I used in the last video on, the, on three. Okay, think of the right hand as my lead hand. So that's what I'm gonna keep track of. If it's the left, think of this as your left hand, okay? So I'm gonna, I'm going to use a numeric method of keeping track of where the right hand is. So if I have four strokes, I don't even need this. I'm gonna show you, I don't even need this. So if I keep track of four strokes, and I have zero right hands, my, that's my lead hand. Then I have one, two, three, four, all left. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. All right, but if I wanna start progressively moving a number, okay, so the, the number one is the first position. Right hand is in the first position. One, two, three, four, okay? One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Now I'm gonna move the right hand into the second. See, I'm moving forward progressively. Pro means forward, grass, move, move forward. So now I'm gonna go one, because the right hand's in the second position. And I'm gonna make it accent. One, two, three, four, 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 one, two, three, four. Now I'm gonna move it into the third position. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Now I'm gonna move it into the fourth position. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. You just created all these combinations just by progressively moving the right hand. Now, that's moving one right hand. Now we're gonna move two right hands. In the first and second position, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. So it's in the first and second. Now we're gonna move it progressively, keeping it together into the two and three. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Now we're gonna move it into the three and four position. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Now we're going to continue keeping it together into the four and it wraps back to one. Four one is the same as one four. Okay? So one, two, three, four, 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 one, two, three, four. So I just moved two hands together that are right next to each other. Now I'm going to separate them. Okay, that means one and three, two, three, four. I separated those right hands by one stroke. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. And now I'm gonna shift that over one. See, progressively moving it over, one stroke. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. So now it's in the two and four. So I say zero, one, two, three, and four. One, two, two, three, three, four, four, one. This numerical method is great for a ton of things. One and three, two and four. All right, got that? Zero, one, two, three, four. One, two, two, three, three, four, four, one. One and three two and four. Now that's moving twos. Now how about threes? One, one, two, three. That's the first three position and there's the four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. 
Now move those three over one position and you have one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. See how that happens? Now I'm going to move those over one. So it's going to be three, four, one. See how I, they're all together, but they, they wrap back to the front of this thing. Three, four, one is the same as one, three, four. One, two, 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 three, four. Now we're going to continue moving that group of three over one more. So now it's four, right? Four is at the end, wrapped to one and two. Four, one, two is the same as one, two, and four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So now we've explored all possible combinations of three right hands. And then finally, all four right hands. One, two, three, four. It's the opposite of one, two, three, four, zero. So you'll notice that there's really eight, and the opposite of those eight makes 16. Just like when there are in the threes, there was actually four unique combinations and then the opposite of those three. That's the exact opposite. Switch it. And that makes eight. So now we got eight and eight is sixteen. Now, just as we did with the threes, and we're not going to go through all these, there's too many. We want to move the accent, the flam, through a pattern. So we got to pick one of those patterns. Let's pick the zero, zero, zero. One, two, three, four. All right. There's zero. Zero means there's no lead hands. One, two, three, four. So we're going to put a flam on the first stroke. One, two, three, four. 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 Now, just like we did, move it to the second and the third and the fourth. That's moving one accent. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Move it to the third position. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Fourth position. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Now, just like we did with the sticking, we got to do combinations of two. One and two, two and three. Three and four, four and one, one and three, two and four. There's all your combinations of two things. In this case, the things are accented flames. We're still sticking with this, right? So now we got one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Now it says move it over the second and third, right? One, two, three, four, one, two, three. So I'm going to say two and three loud. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. That's that rudder telling my body what to do. Now I'm going to go to the three, four. I'm going to say it louder. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Now I'm going to go to the four, one, which is the same as one, four. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Now I'm gonna do the one and three. Alright? One on uh, right? One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Now I'm gonna go to the two and four. Snare drum backbeat, rock and roll. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. All right. Now I've done all the twos. Now we got to do threes. Combinations. One, two, and three position. Then the two, three, and the four position. And then the three, four, and the one position with some gang symbol. Right? And then the four, one, two position. 
Does that look cool or what? Try that man, 4-1-2 position. And then we're right back to one, two, and three. See how it just keeps wrapping around. So we got one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Two, three, and four, make sure you say those louder. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. <laughs> Gotta get that four in there. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Now keep wrapping. Three, four, and one. Okay, same as one, three, four. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Keep wrapping. Four, one, two, same as one, two, four. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. And we're back to one, two, three. Now we gotta do all four. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, 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 one. Alright, so this is how you progressively move, right? using that numeric system, an accent through one of the 16. We use that same numeric method, right, to create those 16 right-left hand combinations or check patterns. This is straight out of, those check patterns are straight out of George Warren Stone stick control, but in a very systematic, progressive method. This is progressive. George Lawrence Stone is not. It's all there, but it's just kind of haphazardly thrown together. All right, so why don't you go through all 16, right? What would be the next one? The right hand in the first position. One, two, three, four, one. If you're right-handed. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. And now you're going to turn that into plan. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. All right. Without any. This is with no accent, right? One, two, three, four. One, two. That's a zero. Zero accent, zero flaming. One, two. First position, one, two, three, four, one, two, here's the accent, zero. Uh, one position, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. One position for accented flam, one, two, three, four, 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 one, two, three, four. I really should go right back up, shouldn't I? So you do that moving to the second position, to the third position, to the fourth position, to the first and second, the second, the third, the third and the fourth, the fourth and the first, the first and the third, the second and the fourth. First, second and third, second, third and fourth, third, fourth and first, fourth, first and second. So always, always just keep going progressively, four, one, two. Think of a phrase staying together. Four one two. That's the phrase. Four one two. Three four one. Four one two. Those keep the phrase together. All right. Wow! Can't wait to hear your comments on this shorter video because most of the teaching was done in the previous video on the three-stroke patterns. It gets really complicated when you go to five strokes. Five stroke patterns, very complicated. But you can think of three stroke and two strokes and combine them. Take all the twos and all the threes and just start doing combinations. What it, that's a good way. Now, I don't know if that's exhaustive. I don't know if that gets them all. But that's a good way to get a lot of them, okay? Uh, common, using that numeric method, it's a lot trickier. I can't, I can't just spout it off. Because you, you have a problem with when you have two things next to each other, no problem. 
in three, three things next to each other and four things next to each other, no problem. But it's when you start separating them. There's so many combinations in five strokes. You have having one or two strokes separating them, separating the strokes. So you, you know, just, it's not as easy. I did it one time. It turned out to be very long. It's in one of my documents on my website. It's probably under... Yeah, it's, I don't re remember where it's at. It's very long. It's a very long document. Okay, well, can't wait to hear from you. That's what this website's about, teaching one another. There's no one-man shows, and we need to learn from each other. So I really welcome your comments. Everybody else does. Stick them down here on the bottom of this video. And on the bottom of the page where you found this video, there's so many more videos on these pages that this is linked to. So look in the description for the link and go there because you can uh, see so much more all organized together, you know, in one place. So can't wait to hear from you, okay? Everybody else is relying on you as well. We have to depend on one another. We have to take care of each other. This, uh, this world is a dog is really turning out to be every man out for himself, you know, dog eat dog. It's, it's horrible. Where's the civility? Where's the love? Where's the civilization? <laughs> it's like eroding. Civilization is not progressing. It's not moving forward. It's definitely regressing. It's not evolving. It's de-evolving. Anyway, thank you so much for your time and can't wait to hear from you. Bye-bye.